we have four different kind of techniques that we are testing in Sweden now. And the first one that we have tested is the region Gävleborg, the Siemens system, a catenary system that we have tested now since 2016. The second test that we started in Sweden was the E-Road Arlanda project. It is a public road outside the airport of Stockholm called Arlanda. We have tested now a road-bound rail system since 2018. And what's interesting with that system, that system can be used by both heavy-duty vehicles and also private cars, which we also have tested. The third system that we now are testing in Sweden is another road-bound rail system, a Swedish company called Elon Road, and the project name is Evolution Road. It is the city of Lund, outside the big city of Malmö in Sweden. This system can also be used by both private cars and heavy-duty vehicles. The fourth system is now an inductive system. And this is also very interesting. We are testing it now on the island of Gotland, on a public road between the airport of Visby and the city of Visby. And we will have a, both a heavy duty vehicle and also bus and probably also a private car traveling on that system. And why are we doing this? We are doing this because we want to have knowledge. All these four demo sites is not permanent facilities. We build them, we test them, we get a lot of knowledge and then we dismantle them. So this is pure testing, nothing else. But once again, it's so important to test it on public road in real traffic situation.